Here are the 15 fascinating things you never knew about ancient mummies. Number 15. There were some blonde mummies. Ancient or modern Egypt is not known for having blondes in their population. That is why the discovery of mummies with fair colored hair was an odd find for some archaeologists. Some Egyptologists believe it was caused by the mummification process, while others think they were just ones that lived during the Greek and Roman rule. Number 14. The mummy's mouth was left open intentionally dotted in what looks like an early version Edward Munch's The Scream, mummies would often have their mouths wide open. This was an important and tough ritual that involved breaking the jaw of the corpse. This was a necessary part of the deceased's regaining of sense for the afterlife. Number 13. There was such a color as mummy brown apostrophe. Mummies were so popular at one point that it was the go-to ingredient for products of all kinds, from medicine to art. In this case, they would ground up mummies and use it as the pigment as a specific kind of paint named after it. It was used for a good 400 years before declining in popularity. Number 12. Mummies came with amazing portraits. Some of the oldest portraits ever made were made, in fact, in association with a mummified body. More than 1,000 portraits were found in the Fayum region of Egypt. Many compare them to the work of Renaissance and post-Renaissance artists. Number 11. Families had lunch with mummies. Since ancient Egyptians believed their loved ones were on a trip to the afterlife, it made sense that they would pack them some lunch. Pharaohs would have tombs stocked with food ready for eternal life. Meats and fish would be covered in a type of resin for preservation, and jars of wine would be left so the ruler could deal with his afterlife in style. Number 10. There was a mummy inside a statue. A thousand-year-old Buddhist statue that was on loan to a Dutch museum was also the home of a mummified monk. The mummy, statute received a CT scan to check out its contents and what they found were astounding. The monk's organs had been replaced with papers printed with Chinese characters. Number 9. A Chinese princess was mummified, too. Lady Dai was an aristocrat during the Han dynasty that was wrapped in layers of silk and four nested coffins. When she was examined after her tomb was found in 1974, they found that her veins were still filled with blood and still had soft tissue. That meant they were able to perform an autopsy on Lady Day. 2000 years after her death. Number 8. Scottish mummies had a serious mix up. Bog bodies are natural mummies that occur when a corpse falls into a peat bog. There are some well known cases, but this 3,000 year old one definitely catches attention. Scientists in Scotland found a pair of bog bodies actually made of six people. Number 7. The length of mummy wrappings are wild. King Tut's bandages ran at about 4.7 meters and were custom made so well that it looked like modern gauze. Still, that's nothing compared to the length of some of other mummies' wrappings who could go as long as 1.6 kilometers. Think about that the next time you make a 5k run. Number 6. Egypt isn't home to the oldest mummies. No one can argue that Egypt has the mummy game cornered. But they are far from the first. All the way to South America were the Chancros of Chile and Peru, whose sites date to 7000 BC. The mummies found across the coast date as far back as 5000 BC. Number 5. Just how weird was using mummies? How about eating mummy flesh weird? Because people were doing that for medicinal purposes since the 12th century. After a while, they stopped caring if it was real mummy meat or not. Number 4. Every organ was pulled out except for one. According to Egyptian beliefs, the heart was the ab, or the power source of character, good, and evil. That was why it was the only organ left inside of the mummy. The ab part of the soul was to be preserved. Number 3. Mummification is for the birds. It's common knowledge that a lot of pets also made it to the afterlife wrapped up in neat packages. In fact, one discovery found that they went overboard on the winged front. In the western desert, scientists unearthed more than 4 million mummies of a stork-like bird called an ibis. Number 2. What they replaced eyes with would make you cry. Eyes were scooped out like every other organ, so there was a cavity that needed filling. In comes a handy vegetable, onions, that would be placed instead. 
empty abdomens were filled with lichen, number one. One pharaoh traveled with class. In 1976, the mummified body of King Ramesses II was to be sent to a French museum for study and much-needed repair. The problem was, according to French law, anyone coming into France alive or dead must come with a passport. Because of this, Ramesses II was given a passport by the Egyptian government, designated as a deceased king, and given funeral procession of full military honors. Thank you.